Good morning, Dennis Smith, wirelessjobs.com. I got to thinking about a post that we had here on the Fordyce letter a couple of weeks ago about all the really cool social networking tools that we have at our disposal. But it also made me think about how too often I revert to those Web 2 tools to contact a customer, a candidate, with Facebook, with LinkedIn, instead of using a good old 1.0 tool like the telephone or a drop-in visit, a handshake, a face-to-face -face meeting. You know, as much as I don't mind the occasional email, I'm not real thrilled about getting my inbox flooded with emails, especially those that I just might miss. But when I go to my mailbox and I see a handwritten thank you card with a really cool, personalized, oversized stamp on the front, I don't delete it. I read it. And so I'm preaching to the choir here, but this is just maybe a challenge to resist the temptation to send another email. Resist the temptation to log into Facebook and leave a message on somebody's super wall. And I challenge you to do something that's going to make a difference, possibly in a potential customer, a candidate. You know, remember, long after people have forgotten what you've said, they will remember how you made them feel. So don't web to it today. Do something old-fashioned. Send a thank you letter. For wirelessjobs.com, this is Dennis.